Hello everyone, hope you're right. In today's video, I'm going to harvest my peas. As you can see, these plants are done now. They are drying up and most of them have been eaten by slugs or snails or maybe caterpillars or beetles. I haven't seen anything eating them, but they have been really badly eaten. So, peas are done now. So, I'm going to harvest all my peas and then I'm going to share a recipe with you which is my favorite recipe not a very big harvest but it smells awesome and it tastes awesome so now I'm going to pull out all my plants which are almost dried and being eaten so I'm going to throw them in my brown bin and I will prepare these beds for planting something else I did plant some cucumber seeds here and only one of them has germinated so for the recipe I have got one medium onion chopped finely and I'm going to add some oil and I'm going to saute onion on medium heat until they turn brown. Meanwhile I'm going to take the peas out of the pea pods. So the onions are brown now and I'm going to add some spices, red chili flakes, cumin seeds, cinnamon stick, black cardamom and two or three cloves. Now I'm going to mix everything really well. Now I'm going to add my homegrown garlic, two cloves finely chopped and a bit of water and mix everything. Now I'm going to add peas which are roughly one cup, mix them well and I'm going to add salt. Red pepper powder. Turmeric powder. Black pepper powder. And some paprika powder. A fresh green chili two medium sized sliced potatoes now I'm going to add three glasses of water so I'm gonna cook one and a half glass of rice. So the amount of water should be double than the amount of rice. And I'm going to use basmati rice. You can use any rice you like. And this is one and a half glass of rice. I am using the same glass for measuring. And I have soaked the rice and I will keep them soaking for 15 to 20 minutes. Meanwhile, my potatoes and peas are being cooked on medium heat. And after 20 minutes now you can see peas and potatoes are softened and cooked and now I'm going to add my rice. I have taken the water out and washed the rice and I'm going to add all my rice and mix them really well. The pot is on full heat and I want all the water to evaporate. I have added another tablespoon of salt so basically for one and a half glass of rice nearly two tablespoons of salt should be enough but you can always amend it to your taste and now I'm going to slice a kumquat um, which is my homegrown kumquat and it tastes really nice in rice dish now all the water has been dried up so I'm going to cover the lid and let it simmer on low heat for 5 minutes and then turn off the heat and let it sim sit for 15 to 20 minutes. After 20 minutes the rice are done and you can see they are nice and fluffy and separate from each other. Everything is cooked nicely and smelling awesome.
Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Please give it a thumbs up and do subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so you don't miss out on any of my gardening videos. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Bye.